Okay, guys, I'm going to explain the game. Ready? Okay, so this is Shimura Island, and you can see this is my monster. That is worth one point. This is Parn's monster right here, and Parn's monster, as you can see, has one, two. That means that it has the best hearing and it's the best heat adaptive. So, this is a game. Uh, this is um, Pepper's monster right there. And as you can see, these are the habitats that have not been claimed. You have... Hey, um, you didn't tell about my habitat yet! Oh, his habitat is natural defenses. And he got that because he has this. We That's a ghetto kiwi because it's a turtle! Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so as you can see right here, we're going to be voting on which monster is the fattest, the largest, the grossest, hard, hard to catch, and the most social. What's so, most social? Most social means like you have the most friends. Like they like to talk a lot. Like ah, social person talks a lot. Cool. Yeah. So as you can see, you learn a lot of new vocabulary playing this game. And the way it works is I'm going to show you right now how it and works. And it's scary. It's my turn. Okay. Yeah. And it's a scary game. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and put it on most social. That's the monster that likes to talk the most. The monster that has the most friends. So everybody, we put one white down. You got to put one baby on it. So put one baby okay, on the card. Okay, okay, good. Wait, wait for me. Okay, good. Now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put our card face down and we're gonna vote on which monster is the nicest and the friendliest and has the most friends. Okay. So everybody vote. Okay. Okay, and we flip it up. Go. Oh, not again. So you can see um, we got two blue and one green. So that means my monster is the most social. Now, because me and Pepper voted for the winner, we get um, one black token. And my monster gets babies. Dude, it's like a bus token from Japanese or what? Like, like a, a bus token? Is it a bus token? I don't know. It's, so, a, it's a game token. It's a game token. It's okay. not a bus token. Okay, and now we do the last phase, and the last phase is this. What you do is um, we're going to be buying. So because it was my turn, I go first. So I can buy one of his monsters. This one costs four. This one costs five. I can buy one of that in three, or I can pay two, which is what I'm going to do, and buy one in my own monster. And that is Kimura Island. It's a good game for. <laughs> It's a good game for vocabulary. You learn a lot of vocabulary. You make really cool monsters. You vote. You have to discuss words. And you have to um, figure out words from context. And it also tests to see, make sure that the kids understand the new vocabulary they're learning. Okay?